So hello everyone and welcome back to part two of the Star Wars Outlaws Let's Play Gameplay Walkthrough, whatever we want to be calling it. Uh, my name's Jay, also known as Fox, and today we're going to be carrying on with part two of this Let's Play series. We're about an hour into the game currently, and if you've not seen the beginning of the gameplay, wow. it's currently up on the channel. We're just going to take a moment to have a little bit of a look around here. We are currently playing this on PC, 4080 Super, uh, maxed out with ray tracing and all the bells and whistles. And I've got to say, the game does look pretty phenomenal. I am pretty amazed at like the size and scope of the planets on this game. I was expecting something far less grandiose in scale, but it's pretty epic to say the least. And I'm pleasantly surprised so far so we're gonna reach mirror miro garner here and there's quite a few people out and about on their speeders what do you get out of this i don't trust charity charity do you know what this baby is it's an eml 850 a custom job check the logs and even found a name the okay trailblazer. The, the trailblazer, trailblazer. <laughs> so so this ship is special uh, you don't get it. Just give me some new fuel injectors. With those, at least we'll be able to fly. All right, all right. I'll figure it out. So, do we stay on the speeder here, or speeder restricted? Ah, I see. So we're going to get off our bike here. Speeder bike. Oh, damn. <laughs> all right, so we're not going that way. Um... I've actually no idea where we need to go here. I'm sure we'll figure it out. So let's just get off again and... We're going to heal up. We're going to use it up on the D-pad here to have a scan about and see if we can get any idea of where we need to go. We're just going to have a little bit of a look around, I suppose. I will say that after all the reviews and stuff that I watched um, and read a lot of people were saying bad things about this game and so far I am pretty impressed with what I'm seeing it does seem pretty epic to be fair but only time will tell uh oh you're Torn Valerio Nup that's me mm-hmm <laughs> Alright, move along. Alright, fair enough. Well, it looks like we've uh, bypassed security. Let's go. Glad I got that fake identity card. Yes. Here are my scan docs. She didn't seem very convincing, but uh, I suppose there's supposed to be a little bit of a comedy value inherent with that. I really am loving. Um, like sort of the vastness i really really hope that this game turns out to be really good and i enjoy it because so many reviews have said that it's a bad title and i just everything i've seen so far like i actually think it looks really really good and this is on patch 1.2 title update 1.2 so this has got a lot of the hot fixes bug fixes and stuff like that so hopefully we're not going to have too many issues. Let's talk to this guy. You want to meet Gorak, Pike underboss? I got a VIP invite to his private suite. Only way to get up there. You interested? I'll give you a deal. Let's walk away and see if we can get Nick to rub it. I'm good. Suit yourself. Distract him next. <laughs> well, that's not going to work, is it? Good boy. So it's not looking like we. Is there anything we can do here? We did steal off somebody in the last episode, so I'm kind of wondering if it's indeed possible to do the same. Talk to the bartender. Here we go. Hey, I need to 
talk to Gorak? You don't look like a pike, and you're not getting up there without an invitation. So this seems like an absolute no-go. So I think we've got two options. We either find a way to sneak up or we get the pass off the guy out there. But we will try and use our data spike here. Right, okay. So, looks like we're not getting in there. Um, oh, dear. There is no plan B. Looks like we're going back to this guy. And we're going to have to sort of batter our way. So, change your mind? Want that VIP invite to Gorak Suite? Yeah, we'll buy it. Uh, yeah, that'd be great. Oh, perfect. Yeah, thanks. Enjoy the suite. Tell him I say hi. So we got the ticket to Gorak Suite now. Well, that was kind of easy. Um, wasn't too expensive on credits either, thankfully. Um, we are very early on in the game, and I don't know how... Uh, Often credits are going to be to come by. So the thing is, if the lift's not working now. Um, okay, let's open this. So we've got to find a way in now. I'm wondering, if we, could we have got out on this balcony before? So why can I not call the lift now? She said VIPs only, but I do have a pass now, so... I'm a little bit confused. So, gonna let me up to see Gorak now? Already told you, not without an invitation. Oh, then it's a good thing I have this. A VIP invite. <laughs> I think someone took you for a ride, kid. VIP invite. Oh! <laughs> I was just testing your, um, security. Gorak will be... <sighs> Never mind. Oh, what the hell? We've been had over. Little douchebag. <laughs> I can't believe it. Where's he gone? Tickets, camera's gone. Hmm. Of course. Well, that's not good. Um, so, what's plan B? Next, go. See if we can steal a pass. Good boy. See if we can steal here. So we got some credits. Using Nick's, of course. Um, so I do wonder how we're going to get through here. This panel's always causing problems. I just replaced the lift's drive unit. See if this hmm. person could help Panel us out. Up. Faulty wiring. It's affecting the turbo lift somehow, too. Oh, yeah? I can take a look, if you want. Used to help out with stuff like this at the cantina back home. Don't know you, so no. You don't know me, but we go way back, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. Must have uh, so interesting. My mind. We can bribe go people and stuff. Room. Do what you gotta do. So maybe this is our way up. Let's go. Let's have a look here. Uh, slice to unlock. Okay. Oh, it's one of these again. Um. So we got a circle that's in the wrong place. So we'll try circle. Oh, no, it's not that one, is it? So it's probably this, this, this. No, really? About this, this, this. 
Did we do it? So we got one in the right place. Uh, two, sorry. So we'll try this, this. Okay. Looks like we're in. That should have unlocked the turbo lift. Okie dokie. So we've unlocked the turbo right. lift. Let's go see Gorak. So the turbo lift's unlocked now. Hopefully the woman behind the... Oh, she has seen us. Oh, no. Hmm, that looks like an underboss. Hmm. Graphics are pretty outstanding on this game, I've got to be honest. Looks pretty, pretty sick. This is Governor Thornton's city. Not yours. <laughs> Oh, Drive damn. Them out and tell the governor the payments will not increase. I don't know you. What? You never make new friends? I have enough friends. No. Oh. Yeah, but you don't have to pay me to hang out with you. <laughs> She's funny. Hmm. Waka sent me. He said, uh, you might have some work. Ah, what a disappointment. Hey, wait. What's your problem? Smart enough to get into my suite? Careless enough to use Waka's name. Oh, what? no. You're new to this world. Come back when you're not. <laughs> Damn, that's not a good start. Waste of time. <laughs> ha! Next, you cheeky little bugger. <laughs> good boy. <laughs> <laughs> Gorax ring, let's go. Stealing from a pike underboss. First day? <laughs> Easy. Name's Donka. I'm a broker for every job on this moon. Not many syndicates where I'm from. Hey, this is legitimate business. Miragana is special, kid. Empire keeps this cantina neutral. But beyond these walls, it's war. You want to survive? Know the players. Look there. The Pikes have the most say, thanks to Gorak. Cutthroat, political. They pay up to play favorites with the Empire. Then, Crimson Dawn. Hungry for Gorak's kingdom. Crafty, sneaky. Unlike the Huts. With them, what you see is what you get. <laughs> Out here, you live and die by your reputation. That said, a friend needs a little something stolen from Gorak's private base. Some information he'd hate to get out. And who's hiring me to steal from the top syndicate in town? <laughs> Sorry, kid. In or out, that's all you get. Tell your client KVS is in. Cute. Desperate, but cute. Making all types of friends already, but I'm liking it. So it's just explained a little bit about the different syndicates. Uh, welcome to the Underworld. Care's reputation reflects how much a syndicate trusts her. A good rep opens doors, rewards opportunities, bad rep closes them. Pleasing the syndicate will often anger another. It's all of Care's reputation to fluctuate when you switch partnerships. Performing a job for a syndicate helps Care get in the good books. Loyalty, change, betrayals are inevitable, and a resourceful outlaw must now to play the underworld to their advantage. Good to know. So, we've got Crimson Dawn, Hook Cartel. Oh my god, how good does Jabba look? Crimson Dawn and Pike Syndicate. Um, okay. So we get different rewards for each and outfits and stuff. This is pretty dope, man. Nice. Uh, cantina brawling. Fast talk. 
armoured undershirt. Account for Tilly Settlements. So there's quite a lot of depth to the game, realistically. I was not uh, expecting a lot of this, to be honest. I really thought it was going to be like quite a shallow experience. Um, I'm pleasantly surprised currently. So we've got the jacket. Got gun holster. So we will be able to get different uh, outfits and whatnot. It's pretty cool. Alright, nice. Infiltrate Gorax base. So the question is, where is Gorax base? Avis, Gorax base is in the bike district. Find the back entrance, slice the terminal in his tower. Steal the file marked SK01. Good luck. Who? Oh, wait, are you the one who hired me? I guess that answers Hello. me question. <laughs> okay. Hey, Waka. Thanks for the help. You almost got me killed. Ah, guess Gorak still remembers me. <sighs> Just tell me how to get into his stronghold. It's in the Pike District. The main entrance is next to that imp checkpoint at the city entrance. That place is full of opportunities for someone like you. But if you're on the Pike's bad side, they won't let you just walk in. I'm sure I can handle it. Let's have a look here. Armored undershirt, cars weave. Ah, right, so he's telling me uh, which components I need uh, when I pick them up for the upgrades and such. So we're going to walk towards the yellow marker. Now, I don't know, if is there a map or? Surely there would be a map, right? Perhaps. Hmm. Doesn't look like there is. We get through here? No. Just gonna keep mooching around. Whoa, 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 what did it say? Checking your blaster? Hopefully, I'm not going to get into too much trouble in this area with my blaster on me. You have just reached a checkpoint here. Um, these guys don't look too friendly. You do not belong here. Just passing through. Just looking. Whoa, 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 whoa. don't shoot. Right. They uh, won't let me in. There's another way. No. Bench around the corner nearby. Okay, if they see you. I know, I know. It'd be bad. Okie dokie. Let's see if we can get in um, this way. Uh, open container. Got some more credits and a necklace. Um, so we should be able to sell these for some more credits. Just wondering how we uh, get inside here. So can we climb up this? So there is indeed a vent there. The problem is... Is it actually down here? Perhaps it's round the other side, maybe? See where Nick's goes. Sometimes the little fella points us in the right direction. This is looking like a bit of a dead end, to be fair. Um, so we can't get through the whoa. Bit of a bug there. Let's 
So I'm a little bit confused to where the vent is. Ah, trickery. We have found it. We have to move pretty swiftly here before we get a scene. And hopefully we're not going to get in too much trouble. I've been told you arrived. There's a way in on the second floor terrace. It will take you where you need to go. Uh, okay. How long have you been watching me? Right. We're going to move over here. Hopefully we won't get caught. Let's go. I hope we are going the right way here. Looks like we are. Oh, I don't know if we should be stealing this stuff, though. Can we get through this? Ultra careful here, we don't get caught. So she did say second floor. So there is another vent there. Use our sense up on the D pad to try and figure out if there's any people around here. So I'm guessing we're going to have to go ar around this way. Perhaps up here. Oh, damn. There's people down here. So perhaps we need to go through here. Possibly find another way. Oh shit. So we kind of got to go this way over here. not entirely sure how the hell we're gonna get up here without getting caught Entirely sure how we're going to navigate this. It seems pretty difficult. Is this going back up? Yeah, this is going back to where we started. So perhaps we can creep through here. Next, snatch that. So we can see through the walls. It's kind of like a sense feature. So perhaps we need to Thanks. 
That looks nice. See if we can grab this. All right, we've got some more ingredients for our underweave. Um, okay, check our time here. Make sure that we don't get caught. And hopefully they're not going to come over this way. Let them walk back. So we do need to... It's second floor, but perhaps... It's looking like it may be in here. Oh, well, then again, I could be wrong. on which way to go. Can we climb this? Yes, let's go. Uh, jump across here, maybe? Okay. Assassin's Creed style. Oh, dear. Nearly fell down there. Alright, let's go. This looks like the way in. Looks like we may be in here. Let's go. We'll be okay next. Yeah. Let's open the vent. Now, how do we get up there? So we got to get up to that gap. Um. Okay. Can we jump up on that? So there are quite a few little uh, puzzly elements to the game, which is pretty cool. Okay, that lowered a turbo lift. Andy. Can we jump up on this? Climb back up the ladder, see if it's uh, give us any way across. Okay. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, looks like we're going to have to get Nyx to uh, Psst, Nyx. call the turbo lift. This should enable us to get across, I think. Oh, all right. This will work. Nice. So far, so good. Looks like we're up here. We have to get next to shut it down, maybe. Next, hold this for me, okay? Go put on a show, next. No, next. <laughs> Stop playing dead. You gotta open the thing, baby. Hey, hold this open. 
Good boy, Nick. Nice. Right, we're through. See if there's anything in here. Some more Jura steel. Nice. Slide under here. You doing okay, buddy? We just gotta do a few jobs like this before we hit it big, right? Okay. So far, so good. I'm pretty impressed with the gameplay, to be fair. Um, I am a little bit bewildered by the amount of negative reviews for this game. Like, maybe the new patch fixed a lot of stuff. There's the tower. That energy barrier might be a problem, though. Okay, Nix. We can go loud now. If we gotta. Pikes. Just mark up all the enemies here. Um, best we can. Trouble ahead. So we've got to make our way. Down there, it would appear. We're going to do our best there to stealth as much as possible. Oh. We lost a fair bit of health there from that jump. enemies um so how did we use the binoculars before to mark up a few of these. Oh my god. Get inside here. See if we can make our way through undetected, if possible. We get into that ladder there. Why do I have to do this? Prove yourself. Move up. Nice. Got him. So we've got a opportunities in this city that we are missing. We should be worrying about Crimson Dog. Go Nix, you know what to do. See if we can get him to power it off. Go on, Nixy baby. Okay, guess there's another one of these things. <laughs> that's quite funny. Um Alright, so that's one. Question is, where is the second one? You say it's 24 meters that way. I am ready to be an underboss. I just need the position to open. No one is getting by. No, it was nothing. Leave it. It's looking like the other one is. 
much for going quiet, Nick. Uh oh. Oh, we we messed up. We messed up. We messed up big time. Are you joking? God damn it. We're in trouble. Oh, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. No, we can't climb up that. So, um... We need to find this other uh, energy cup link quick. Oh my god. We definitely, definitely need to find it. Oh, we are in big trouble. Really need to find this uh, energy uh, generator. He's saying he's over here, but oh my god! I literally can't see it. So it is supposed to be around here. At least we got a proper uh, laser now. Blaster, should I say? Um. God, where is it at? Have I just dropped the gun? Oh my days! I can't take a laser up the. Uh, up the ladder. That's pretty bad. Let's sabotage this. Okay. Oh, good job. We lost them. Is this it? <laughs> we did it. Who cares if this Nice. Alright. Let's go. I'm guessing the idea is to be a little bit more stealthy than what I'm doing, but... I've got to be honest, I do enjoy shooting the laser, the blaster. Why do I keep calling it a laser? <laughs> Let's go. Um, so we've pretty much cleared this place out. So we need to move towards the door now. And crack on with the mission. Um, so it's down this way, I think. Oh, my God. Weird things keep happening to me. Sabotage that. So where on earth is the door that I need to go through? Oh, there we go. It's kind of annoying that there's no map. Just a compass at the top. Don't know if that's maybe an option that I can enable. Grab this, grab this. 
So, the data file, break into the tower. So we're not quite there yet, it would appear. Terminal. Certainly have. There we go. A bit tricky, that. So we've got some more credits here. So, oh, here's the terminal. Oh, no. The system has an alarm. Uh-oh. Uh, the file's just a spotchka recipe. 12 parts grill, one part spob. Oh, <laughs> what is this? I'll make this worth my while. Ooh, encrypted file. So, it's that and that. There we go. Easy. Okay. Are we in? this overthrowing someone like Gorak takes time if I couldn't secure a channel I'd be long dead don't call me Tislak well Tislak I'm old fashioned if I'm going to stab a friend in the back I'd like to meet the person handing me the knife of course governor uh oh and there's the alarm well at least we got something Was that a blast in our way out of here? Oh, what we get into, buddy? Yeah, we got a big blast now. Let's go. Oh, they walked down the elevator. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, we can climb. Uh, oh. There goes my blaster. Uh, don't worry, next the. Uh, Next job will be better. Okay. Can we even jump across this? Okay. And up. Let's go. Definitely an ambitious game, this, by the looks of it. Oh no, jammed, jammed. Alright, we're gonna have to find, figure it out. Um, whoa, what the hell? Better than nothing. Let's get out of here. Damn, everything's a lockdown. Um, we need a way out, Nix. Um. Ah, vent. Let's go. Handy. Uh, 
I don't even like the fact that you drop your blaster when you climb up and down things. It's kind of annoying. Whoa. Uh, Let's go. I got this. Whoa! I got this. Why on earth did he not just drop down to the next level? That was really bad. I thought I was gonna die though. Some of the camera shots, though, are absolutely beautiful. So I am kind of starting to think that there is an issue with NVIDIA DLSS and this title. But I'm sure we will find out in due course. I've had a couple of crashes. Um, but it looks to be resolved as of now. Swing across here. So, providing we play native, we should be okay. Uh oh, ooh. Hopefully, I think we're good, next. We're out. Are we out? We pull that off. Let's go. Walker, how fast can you fix that ship? I know, I know. You want to get off to Shara, but fuel injectors don't come cheap. You get paid? Uh, maybe. You know anyone who'd buy proof that some Pike is trying to overthrow Gorak? Uh, Gorak would. Just leave my name out of it this time. Okay. So it looks like we are gonna Oh, can we call our speeder? Let's get out of here. Oh nice. I was kinda of wondering how that works when we left it in the city. Uh alright, hold on. Let's get out of here. So yeah, a successful mission there. Um which I'm pretty goddamn happy about. And hopefully, disabling DLSS now is going to stop the crashing issue that I've been having today recording, which has been a little bit frustrating. Nonetheless, well, there does appear to be a slight issue with DLSS in this title. So moving forward, I am going to have to disable that. Um... Just trying to figure out which is the most optimal way to go. It's not incredibly obvious which way you're supposed to go. The compass is not the greatest, I'm afraid. Uh-oh. Right, so speed restricted. So we've got to return to Danka. I think that's how you say it. And hopefully she's going to have some uh, credits for us. Let's just see what this is. Nix, make no Over there. We are not friends. We'll get Nix to steal this and hopefully get some credits. Good job. Good boy. Accu Accelerator. I'm just trying to figure out how on earth we uh, get through here. It's looking like we are going to have to go around regardless. Um, but it's like I said, the map's not the best. Perhaps we can go up this way, actually. Our lack of map's not the best. But I suppose it does lead to more exploration of the planet and whatnot. Well, so far, I'm thoroughly impressed. These uh, open worlds and stuff like that. Uh, it's pretty awesome. So we're going back into the bar here, and hopefully Danka's going to be here. There we go. Beautiful. Did I pass your client's test? Why don't you ask her yourself? Meet Valera of Crimson Dawn. You the one I was talking to before? You pulled it off. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. I heard you stole something much bigger than this. A ship. Someone's favorite ship. Someone important. I, I, uh, I have no idea what you're talking about. Recognize her? Because Zerek Best showed up with one of their best. Asking 
a lot of questions. Uh oh. A death mark from Zarek Pesh. What did you tell them? Nothing. For now. You work for us again? It stays that way. The pikes are on top here. And Crimson Dawn is making moves. Hmm, form. Hmm, you're gonna have to keep a sweet for now because uh, we've got a death mark on our head. I uh, don't know which one to go with. We'll do this. Crimson Dawn, forget it. Let's go. You want to uh, make a move? One of Gorak's men is planning to betray him. Pike higher up, named Tislak Shar. Really? Hey, look at you. Playing the game. You're learning. Here, some fuel injectors for that ship you don't have. These should help you get off Toshara. So you know everything, huh? Just the things that are important to us. You'll be hearing from me soon, so try to stay alive. Oh, and uh, one last thing. Yeah? Bram's leg is healing nicely. Thanks. <laughs> You're in our world now, Kay. Keep sharp. Welcome. I got those fuel injectors. Time Very go. nice. So there you go. Fast. You're What's damn right. The trailblazer needs time. Attention. Uh, no rush. I just uh, want to keep moving. Fine. Go see if you can find more work. Parts that she needs ain't cheap. Uh, I'll talk to Danka. But it doesn't have to be perfect. Just make it work. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Part two now comes to a conclusion. I thoroughly enjoyed that. I mean, some quite interesting mechanics there. Sadly, I did have a few crashes with the game during this episode, but I think it's directly tied to something with the NVIDIA features of the game. So I've disabled them for the continuation of the playthrough. So I'm not using DLSS or any NVIDIA specific features. I'm just running it native. Um, native resolution with temporal anti-lasing, which is what the game engine was originally designed for. So hopefully, moving forward, touch wood, we're not going to have any more issues. But I hope you've enjoyed today's episode. If you have, give it a thumbs up. If you disliked it, give it a thumbs down. Drop me a comment below and tell me what you thought. And I'll see you guys in the next one. And don't forget, if you're not subscribed already, consider doing so as we are on the push to 2K subscribers. And it would mean the world to me. But with all that out of the way, I'm going to leave you and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.